Do you think something's in there for you? <laughs> hey guys. Um, so the past, what? What, you want this? You think this is for you? There must be treats in this box. It's partially opened, because I was gonna open it up and then I thought, no, I'm gonna wait, because I knew I had some other packages coming. And I thought, no, I'm gonna wait until those come um, and do one video opening them all. But there must be treats in this box right here because my dogs are trying to get it open because I, as you can see, I opened it up a little bit and they want in there really bad. <laughs> so, like I said, um, I knew I had some packages coming so I thought I'd wait for them to all come in and um, film a video and open them up. So I've got a couple cards here. I'm gonna open those first. Um, this is from Doc the Schnauzer. Um, Doc is on Instagram. And I'm assuming this is probably a Halloween card. Yes, you want to see? You want to see? Kim, hope your family has a great Halloween with those crazy boys. Love, Doc. Oh, my goodness. Oh, it's so cute. Oh, like I said, you can find Doc on uh, Instagram. His Instagram page is Doc the Schnauzer. Isn't that so cute? Thank you. I love all the pictures you take of Doc. I'm not on Instagram very often. I do post some pictures and stuff, but I don't tend to scroll through Instagram like I do Facebook. And Facebook, I really haven't been on that much anymore either, um, except to post on my Schnauzer on Facebook page. But Doc is a cutie. Okay, this is from Natalie in Oklahoma. There's something heavy in here. I'll be careful. What's another Halloween card, boys? It says, trick or doggy treat. Wishing you a treat-filled Halloween. Happy Halloween. I found this magnet while traveling in Boston and thought it looked like your boys. Love, Natalie and Walter. Oh, it does. Thank you, Natalie. It's so cute. That is a cute magnet. That's going right on my fridge. Thank you so much. Thank you so much for thinking of me. Okay. All right. Now, this one is from, it says J. I'm not going to say the last name, but I'm pretty sure it's Jennifer from Texas. So let's open this one up, boys. I got my box cutter here. I'm always scared I'm gonna cut something. Okay, there's a card. Yes, what do you smell? You smell something in there? You smell something in there? Huh? <laughs> my mom is biting the envelope. No, no, you don't bite that envelope. Okay. Oh, this looks like it's a Halloween card maybe too. It's got a Halloween sticker on it. read this make sure something I should share okay it says Chanel's your mom I saw this and I automatically had to get it for you you and your pups bring so much happiness into my life plus my daughter Emily is your biggest little fan she always looks forward to your postings this little this little gift just, just because gift is a small token is a thank you for sharing your life and being the best person you can be hopefully you love it Jennifer and then it has it had a little tag on there that said, P.S. Happy Halloween. Okay. Hi, Emily. Oh, it's in little, look, it's in little Halloween wrapping paper. Yes. Hey, you be nice to him. He wants to see you. Magnum thinks he's the boss. <laughs> he thinks he's the boss of everyone. Yes, he does. Oh, my goodness. Oh my goodness! Oh. <laughs> hey, you be nice. He's always loud. He never does anything, but he like, he's very vocal to the other boys. They get too close when he thinks he should be there seeing everything and not them. Oh my gosh, Th this Schnauzer ornament is so adorable. I've never seen anything like it. Look at this. Oh, the lighting is terrible. I hope you guys can see that okay. Isn't that the cutest? I can't wait to put that on my tree. 
Oh my goodness, thank you so much, Jennifer and Emily. Thank you so much. Oh, I can't wait for Christmas, you guys. I cannot wait. Look it. Oh, I don't want them to bite it. Look, it's a little schnauzer ornament. Oh, I know he tried to bite it. How did I know? Yes, you want to sniff it? You want to sniff it? Milo, you don't bite it. No. You want to see now, Magnum, you little bossy little schnauzer? Yeah. No, no. You don't bite it. Thank you so much. It's so cute. Okay. All right. I need to keep all this stuff so I have everybody's address to send a thank you. Okay. Um, here we go. Let me finish cutting this box open. Now, this has um, styrofoam in it, so I don't want the dogs to get a hold of that. Oh, I already cut it all the way. Okay. All right. Oh, I guess I, okay, this one has a card and a little, here, I don't want the dogs to get the star home. <laughs> Let me close that while we read the card. Happy Halloween. It says, at this special time of year when jack-o'-lanterns glow, it's fun to send good wishes and a Halloween hello. Miss you all and hope everything is okay. Emily and Lily. Um, she probably didn't see my post, um, saying I'd be off for a little bit while I was painting the house. So, yep, everything's good, Emily. Um, everything's good. And this is what was inside the card. Oh, this is so cool. It's like a little um, tag, like you could hang it like, on a handbag. Oh, the lighting is terrible. Maybe if I back up a little. It's like a little schnauzer and you could hang it like on a handbag or a backpack. Isn't that cool? It says ch chala handbags. Let me show you guys. Let me show you the tag. So cool. Thank you. That is so cool. I've never seen anything like this. Okay. Let's see here guys. I think there's treats in here because they've been going nuts over this box. All right. Oh, there's some toys. Emily always sends them some cute toys. Look at some new doggy toys. Look at that. Yes. Let's see what else is in here. Oh, another doggy toy. It's, a, it's like a, um, what does it say here? Jack Skellington plush ball toy. I'll show you guys these all up close after I get them out. Magnum, be nice to your brother. Be nice to your brother. Another Halloween toy. Like I said, I'll bring these up closer. Let me get them all out. Oh, yep, there's some doggy treats in here. Oh, wait, let me see here. Let me get this real quick. There's another doggy toy. It's kind of interesting looking. I'm going to have to open that up to see what that looks like. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Let me show you guys. Okay. Let's bring everything up close to show our friends. And then we'll check. We'll let you guys check them out. <laughs> okay. So we have two containers of some Halloween treats. Listen to Magnum back there. Two containers of Halloween treats that they are gonna enjoy immensely. And then, am I almost taking a toy already? No, no. I better put these over here. I better put those over here. And then we have this cute Halloween toy. And then we have this Halloween ball. I wonder if it squeaks. Oh yeah. Then we have these. Oh, oh! This one looks like a werewolf. This one looks like a scarecrow. And a witch. Oh my goodness, they're so cute. Now this, I don't know. This is different. Let's see what this is. Tim Burton's the nightmare, the nightmare Before Christmas. Cackles and squeaks. 
comforting textures. This is cute. Look at this. They're gonna love playing tug war with this. Oh yes. Thank you so much, Emily. My or my no, I gotta take the tags off. I gotta take the tags off. Here. Let's get some tags off. Okay, here you go. Here's your ball. Okay, hold on. There you go. You don't wanna eat the tags, boys. You don't wanna eat the tags. This one I'm gonna have to cut. Let me get the box cutter. Sorry guys. <laughs> I hope this is entertaining for you and not boring. <laughs> well, that one is a tough one. Cut away from yourself, Kim. Cut away. Here we go, Mozzie. You're really looking for this one, aren't you, Mike? No, no. Mozzie wants that one. Mozzie wants that one. Hold on, Moz. Just use your teeth, right? Just use your teeth. Here you go, Moz. Here you go, Mozzie. Yes. Here you go, Mig. Oh, what's that? <laughs> There's some toys right here, boys. Look here. Here's some toys. Yes, here's some toys. They just all want the same toy. Yes, they do. They all want the same toy. Thank you so much, Emily. That was so sweet of you. Okay. Gotta keep this so I have address. Okay. All right. Now these next two boxes, sorry, sorry for the cut in the video, but my daughter started knocking on my bedroom door because she couldn't find something and the dogs went nuts. So, um, anyways, so these next two packages are from a gentleman who reached out to me via email. Um, he told me that last year, um, he lost his two schnauzers and he lost his wife to, I believe, Alzheimer's. And he reached out to me because they had collected uh, schnauzer figurines from the Danbury Mint and he was hoping that he could pass them along to me. And I told him it would be an honor. It was an honor that um, he thought of me to pass these treasures along to me and that I appreciated it so much. And I would definitely um, cherish them for the rest of my life. So um, he sent a couple packages here and I'm gonna open them up and we'll see what they are. No, no, you don't want your nose by that. You do not want your nose by that. These are coming all the way from Rhode Island. It's a basket of schnauzers. It's a Christmas basket of schnauzers. It is so beautiful. Oh, I need to get this in better lighting. Hold on, guys. Okay, is this better lighting? I think it is. Look at that. Isn't that beautiful? It's a mama schnauzer with her baby schnauzers. Milo, you're hitting my camera. So pretty, thank you so much. Oh, it's beautiful. Um, Milo, get away from the tripod. <laughs> no, no, I better not sit that there. I better put it right back in the box. Oh, okay, let me turn the camera back around. That lighting the other way was just terrible. Okay, let me adjust my camera. Oh my goodness, it's so beautiful. I'm hoping, oh, I'm back in camera. I'm hoping um, to someday have um, let me move the camera up. To have bookshelves along, on the other side of this wall is my living room. And there's a wall here that I was thinking about putting a table and a picture and all that. Well, I've left it blank because I'm hoping to save up the money to get 
bookshelves from Ikea and have uh, bookshelves all along that wall. And to be able to display a lot of the things that I've gotten from you guys over the years, um, a lot of it's still boxed up from the move um, because I don't have um, enough shelving to put everything. So I'm hoping to get some bookshelves along that wall in the living room and display some of the beautiful things you guys have sent me. Um, I had a lot of it out in that other in my grooming room at the other house, but I don't have a separate grooming room anymore. Um, so a lot of it is still boxed up. Um, but hopefully soon here we can save up and buy those bookshelves for that wall. Okay, here's another box here. I'm not showing any addresses. I don't think I am. Turn this like this. <laughs> what are you growling for? You think Rachel's outside the door again? Hmm? You think Rachel's outside the door? a um, schnauzer Christmas train set um, oh my goodness how am I gonna show this um, let me just leave it in the box Let's see if I can do this oh my goodness thank you so much I don't want it to tip out um, let me take one out oh my goodness and on the train, this piece, it says, I love miniature schnauzers. Look at that. Oh my goodness. <gasps> Thank you so much. Oh, like I said, I'm gonna cherish these for the rest of my life. Oh my goodness. I'm in, oh, look at this side. Look at, that's probably the front right there. Yes, that's the front, because Sienna's looking that way. Oh, this is so beautiful. So beautiful. Let me take another one out, guys. Okay. This the front of the train. Look at this. I'm in awe. I thank you so much, John, for sending these to me. Oh my goodness. It is gorgeous. I cannot wait to set this up. I cannot wait for Christmas. I want it to be Christmas all year round so I can leave this stuff out all year round. Oh my goodness, it's beautiful. Thank you so much. And look at it, it even has like little paper dog bones right here hanging on a string. It says the miniature Schnauzer Christmas Express. Oh my goodness, this is gorgeous. I cannot wait to show my husband when he gets home. Let me show you another piece. We stop for fire hydrants. <laughs> oh my goodness. I love it so much. This is good. And remember guys, remember the couple who sent me the um, Schnauzer Christmas tree. Oh my goodness. This is going to look so cute next to it. The detail on this. The little Schnauzer ears. I got styrofoam on me. Oh my goodness. I, I can't say thank you enough. Thank you so much. This is just gorgeous, gorgeous. And I appreciate it so, so much, so, so much. Okay guys, I'm getting styrofoam everywhere. <laughs> I'm gonna have to vacuum. Okay, so I'm just, I'm just in awe. You guys are so, so kind to us, so kind. I have, I can never say thank you enough. Um, for the kindness over the years that you guys have shown um, myself and my boys. I, I appreciate it so much. I'm gonna start crying. I'm gonna start crying, oh my goodness. Just that you guys. <laughs> oh, let me fix my camera. Let me fix my camera. <sighs> I just, I get overwhelmed. Um, by just that you guys when you're out and about just that I even pop up into your mind and the boys pop into your mind when you're out 
shopping and, uh, and think of us to send us little gifts. I appreciate it so much. And oh my goodness, this thing, this little Schnauzer ornament is so cute. The little tag, the toys for the boys. I just appreciate it so much. And I should never let negative comments ever affect me because you guys are so, you don't know how much you guys mean to me. <laughs> to think of me, um, to pass along things like that to me, I just, it means so much to me. And I'm so happy that you guys like our channel and that I can share um, my life with the boys with you. Um, I should never let negative comments get me down because you guys show me all the time how much you um, love and appreciate uh, my boys and myself. So I hope. I've been looking into the, my camera's crooked, I'm sorry guys, <laughs> I'm so sorry, um, <laughs> I was trying to get a toy. You need help? Did it go under the bed? <laughs> Hold on guys, I gotta get a ball out from under the bed. Oh, it's only, <laughs> Mar Marley's under there with a toy. Oh, Milo, you poor baby, come on. Marley's under there with a toy and the ball went by Marley and I think Milo was a little nervous to try to get it. Um, what was I saying? Oh, I've been looking into the um, vacation rental homes and I found one um, that says they accept pets. And um, I think it's a mile outside Rome, Georgia for the Schnauzer Fest. Um, so I sent a message to um, the um, owner of the property um, telling them that I have six schnauzers. I told them I have a YouTube channel in case they want to check out my channel so they can, it, maybe that'll help them in their decision of, um, if we can stay there or not to know that we don't let our dogs destroy the house. Max is right under my tripod. So if the camera moves, I apologize. Max, you gotta come over here. <laughs> come over here. You're gonna knock that over. Um, so, um, and they said they would charge an extra fee. So I'm trying to find something that's not too expensive because, um, the, uh, if I can find a vacation rental home that isn't too expensive that, because I know I'll have to book it. I need to book it soon if we're going to go next year. Um, uh, and then later on in the year we can save up and save up for a, um, a bigger vehicle to drive down there but I'm hoping to get there I'm trying and um, seeing what I can do because um, I, I and I gotta also um, Monday I'm going to the city to talk to them about what I the meetup I'm planning and to talk to them if people bring dogs I just want to make sure that I don't do anything wrong or to upset anybody um, with the city so um, I'm hoping and trying to find a way so if you guys want to come here or if I can get down south um, to meet some of you guys because like I said um, you guys mean so much to me and your your kindness is just overwhelming sometimes um, and I would love to meet some of you um, instead of just you know getting packages and not comment here and there I'd like to see you guys face to face so okay I'm gonna let these dogs outside they've been in the bedroom with me <laughs> too long they're ready to go run so i will talk to you guys in the next video thank you guys again so much